So I've only ever caught a few fish on a jig and I've never had a good day jig fishing. So today I'm gonna try to gain some confidence in jigs. All I'm gonna do is flip this around and yeah, hopefully we can get on some bass. Let's just get right into it. There's a fish. There we go. That's a nice one too. Yep, that's a nice fish. On the jig. That's a nice fish. There we go guys, let's go. Oh man, that's a nice fish. Dang. Crush the jig. There we go. Guys, look at how he ate that. That is crazy. Absolutely crushed it. That's a stud. Look at the head on this thing. That's crazy. That's a nice fish, guys. Oh my gosh. Guys, I casted in there. I felt something. I didn't know if it was a bite or not, but I casted back and this guy just started running with it. Really nice bass on the jig. He crushed it. That's a stud. Let's see you, bud. And off he goes, guys. That's so sick. That's a nice fish. There we go. Nice one. Nice one. Oh, it's a snakehead, I think. Nope, it's a bass. Jeez, that's a nice fish. Oh my gosh. Wow, guys, I did not think it was that big. That's a nice fish. Another really good bass. I was swimming my jig in and he crushed it. Boom. There we go, guys. Another one on the jig. Another really nice fish. Look at that. That's a healthy bass. I thought it was a snakehead. He was like doing some head shakes and stuff. <clears throat> that was a weird, but nice bass. Guys, another really nice fish. It's a solid bass. Look how pretty he is. That's such a pretty fish. And there he goes. Sweet, guys. That's awesome. God. That's a just, oh my god, that's a giant fish, oh my god, oh my god guys, I just switched up spots, and that was my first cast, that is a monster, oh my gosh, oh wow guys, that's a stud, look at that jig, oh my gosh, guys, first cast, I switched up spots, I wasn't getting any bites. First cast here, I got destroyed. Let's see how big this guy is. Four point nine five. Five pounder. My scale isn't in ounces, it goes up to point ten. So yeah, that's pretty much a five pounder. That's a stud. Now I got a three pounder, another three pounder, and a five. So I'm at three fish with eleven pounds. That's awesome, guys. Look at this stud. It's a nice fish. Guys, another tank, five pounder. Another freaking giant. That is so sick. Look at this, guys. That's a stud. And there he goes. Let's go, guys. That's sick. All right, here's the cross I'm using. I'm using these net baits. I think they're, they're pretty cheap. I got them at Walmart, and they come with a ton. 
So yeah, they've been working pretty good. They have some insane action. There we go, guys. Sweet. All right, let's get back to fishing. So I don't know if I've mentioned this yet, but the gear I'm using is a 7.2 Heavy PC Fun Torrent Rod and then a Shimano Metanium DC. And yeah, I have on, I think, 25 pound braid, something like that. And then the jig I'm using is from Striking, I think it was like $4. It's a one half ounce football jig. So yeah, hopefully we can get some more fish. That was sick, guys. There we go. Oh my gosh. Guys, that was a good one. Guys, that thing crushed it. I don't think he's going to eat again. There we go. Got him. Another good one. Yep, that's a nice fish. Nice fish. Nice fish. Oh my gosh. That's insane. Every fish I've caught today on the jig have been over two pounds. This is like a two and a half. Get up here. There we go. Nice fish, guys. Another solid bass. Not as big as I thought. Probably like two pounds. That was like a two and a half, three pounder. But I'll take it. On the jig. He crushed it. There we go. That's awesome. Every bass today has been over two pounds. That's now four fish with, I think, 13 pounds. It's a pretty good bag so far. See, bud? There's a fish. There we go. Snapped off. Damn. Guys, that was another good one. That felt huge. All right, I got one more jig. Dang it, guys. All right, so I'm actually, I think I'm going to try this as the trailer. A Guggen Bates Cracking Cross. And then let's see where my jig is. So it is an enticer. Bass Pro Shops brand jig and this is a one half ounce as well so this should be pretty much the same exact thing just a different brand and a slightly different color and a shape look at that sweet all right hopefully I don't snap this off all right guys got the jig tied on let's try out these Guggen baits they're slimy oh this is actually my first ever time trying out Guggen baits, so let's see how they do. All right, sweet. Now, the problem with Guggen baits is that it's eight dollars per pack. Like this, literally, this one pack of crosses is eight dollars. So each bait is really expensive, and then this comes with like twenty crosses, and it's only I think like I think it was like three dollars at Walmart. But yeah, we'll test the difference between these net baits and the Guggen baits. There it is. That's the jig. This looks so sick, guys. This is definitely gonna get a freaking five pounder. There we go. Oh gosh, big, big, big. Oh my gosh, giant. Oh wow, that's a stud. Another big fish. Guys, he crushed it. Boom, that's another giant. Let's go guys, it's a stud. Another three pounder, maybe four. I'll weigh this one too. That's a nice fish guys. Look at that jig, it's gone. Guys, look at that, he choked it. I'm gonna guess around a three. Yep, three point, 3.38. Guys, another really pretty and really solid bass. Three pounder. That means I have a 16 pound bag right now. 
Here's my fifth fish. Oh guys, I just had a fish. Jeez. It's pretty good. Let's flip this out. Oh, there he is. Dang, he fought. He fought really hard. That was insane. Oh my gosh. Another two pounder. It's another solid fish. He crushed the jig. Look at that. Guys, I definitely gained a ton of confidence in jigs. Another really solid bass. And there he goes. Sweet. There's a fish. He snapped me off. Well, there goes my last jig, guys. I guess I'll switch to the Texas rig now. That sucks. All right, guys, I had no idea I had this, but I somehow found another jig in my bag. So hopefully this doesn't snap off, but let's hopefully get a couple more bass. Oh, oh my gosh, I just got destroyed already. That was insane. I was swimming that and something crushed it. There we go, got him. Little guy. That's what was messing with me. Guys, I just re-rigged, took one little cast. This guy hit it as I was reeling in, flipped back out, and he crushed it. First tiny bass I've caught on a jig. But yeah, smallest fish of the day. See you, bud. There's a fish. There we go. Nice one. Oh, just kidding. Guys, he crushed it though. Another little guy. Look at how he ate that. Guys, they really want this jig. That's insane. See ya. There we go. Nice one. Oh my gosh. Giant. Guys, good fish. There we go. Another three pound it stud. Crushed my jig. Guys, he, this guy hit it on the fall. That was insane. Nice fish. See, bud. Oh. And I'm soaked. Here's a fish. Guys, another good one. That's crazy. Every fish today has been quality. That's insane. On the jig again. Guys, I'm having a crazy day. Another solid bass. See you, bud. All right, guys, that's going to do it for the video. I had an insane day. I think I ended with, I think, around a 17-pound bag, which is insane. I had, like, four three-pounders, and then I had a five-pounder, which is absolutely crazy. I had an insane day. But, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Fishing Forward.